Hi everyone, um, I'm here outside and wanted to share some ideas and tips with you for things that you can do while you are feeling distant from others, um, either socially isolated um, in order to flatten the curve as they say, or even if you are maybe feeling frustrated um, with kind of the media, with others' reactions to what's happening, um, for opinions that don't match your own, um, just general stress and anxiety even when you can't pinpoint the source just to give you some tips for lessening distress and self-soothing so um, the first one that I want to mention is where I am and that's just being outside um, take a break from where you are um, whether you're at home at work um, if you have the opportunity to walk outside just listen to the birds for a minute um, feel the air Feel the sunshine on your face. Thankfully, we have some today. Um, smell spring in the air. Take a short walk um, outside if you can. If not, walk around where you are. Walk around inside your house or your office floor. Um, the feeling of your body moving side to side can really just help your brain um, kind of calm and process through some things. And generally, engage your senses. So stop and be mindful of the sights that are around you, the colors, the textures, reach out and touch something, notice how it feels, um, find a scent that you really enjoy, a taste, um, maybe a piece of hard candy or a mint, something flavorful in your mouth, um, notice what you hear, um, take some time to just breathe and be still and be present in the moment. Some other things that I'd like to suggest are um, things that you can do yourself that are some techniques from emotional freedom techniques, EFT tapping, and um, see if I can show you these while I'm holding my phone, um, but some of them are, are pretty simple. So if you see this part of the side of my hand, just gently tapping on that part of your hand um, is one good spot and also the top of your head. Try to move where you can't see the sun quite as much. That's a little better. So gently tapping on the top of your head. Moving down to above your eyes, particularly this spot at the inner corner of your eyebrow. Tapping here in the outer corner underneath. Here. And by the way, you can spend longer in these spots as long as is comfortable. Um, just moving so that I can show you the different spots under your nose, chin, under your collarbone. And then the other one's a little bit harder to show, but it's actually, if you lift your arm, it's actually under your arm, about four inches below your armpit. Um, for, um, for women, this is generally about where the bra strap hits. And um, tap that spot as well. Another one, if you look at the back of your hand in between your ring finger and the little finger, your pinky, um, it's just kind of like between, can't really see, holding a phone. Um, but gently tapping that spot and also gently tapping the tops of your fingers with your hands like this right at the edge of the nail. And as you begin your tapping sequence, um, phrases like, by the way, I apologize for the background noise and construction going on, but phrases like, even though I'm feeling, and then fill in the blank, even though I am feeling anxious, I can accept that and be okay. Even though I am feeling anxious and continue going down, perhaps stress and anxiety are showing up for you as muscle soreness, aches and pains, a stomach ache, a headache, sleeplessness. Um, you can apply the same thing, starting here, kind of this, the side of the hand, the head, moving all the way down. So I'm just gonna start here since I'm holding the phone. Um, and I'm feeling right now the gosh, my neck and the top of my shoulders are sore, even though I feel this pain in my shoulders. I can be okay. I can let it go. 
even though I feel uncertainty. I know that I will make it through. Fill in the blank for you. Do what works for you. If I can be of any help during this time, please reach out to me. I'm working some different kind of hours these days as I've moved to all telehealth for clients and trying to find and share resources that everyone can use. So um, please text me, please call me. I'm available for um, telehealth sessions. Those can be by phone. Um, wherever you need to be. They can be in your car, parked cars better, um, but they can be in your car, they can be in your bedroom at home, they can be outside, um, wherever you can find a little bit of privacy. We can talk by phone or by video session. So I hope this has been helpful and please let me know what questions you have or how else I can help.